What's up guys, I'm Rasim from RossmerTech.com and in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys some simple input and output in assembly. So let's get started. Up here we have some directives. Here we have a model of small. This is the data directive with nothing in it. Underneath that is the code directive. Now in the code directive we have a bunch of lines of code. I'm going to describe what each one of these lines of code are doing. Let's start with the first one over here. Move into AH1H. Now this is uh, assembly code for read a character. Now what this is doing is it's it's telling the program that we're going to enter a character and it's going to wait for that character until we enter it. So when we do enter that character, the character will be stored in the AL register. So remember that. This next line of code here, INC21H, is a DOS interrupt. What this is doing is just telling the program to initiate this here. Underneath that, we're moving the value of AL into DL. Again, AL is where our character is stored and we're moving it into DL. I'll explain this step a little bit later. So let's just skip onto this here. Move 2H into AH. That's the code for read a character. So when this is initiated, it's going to look, look in the D DL register and it's going to print whatever's in a DL register. That's the main reason I, we moved AL into DL. So when we get to this step, it's going to print our character in DL. So again, underneath that is the INC21H, which basically initiates this code here and it's gonna display our character on the screen. So let's test it out. I'm gonna hit emulate and I'm gonna hit run. So right now it's waiting for us to enter a character. We're gonna enter a character. I entered one, by the way. And uh, as you can see, entered one one. The reason why one one was entered, or just the reason why one one was displayed is because the first character uh, we entered one it uh, it saved it in the program in the al register we moved it from the al register to the dl register and we, we then printed it so that's why it printed twice so let's let's uh, let me go over this one more time this first line of code here move one h into a h is the code for read a character again it, this is going to tell the program that we're going to enter a character once we've entered that character it's going to save it in the al register so under it is the INC21H. What it's doing, it's a DOS interrupt and it's telling the program to initiate this. Underneath that, we're moving our character, which is saved in AL, into the DL register. Underneath that, this is the code for write a character. Move to H into AH is again, the code for write a character. So it's gonna look inside the DL register. So whatever is stored in the DL register, it's gonna print on the screen. So that's why, again, we moved AL into DL. And underneath that, INC 21H is a DOS interrupt and it just initiates this so it then it prints it on the screen. All right, so that's pretty much it. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give me a like. And also, if you want more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. I'm Rissim from RossMotech.com and thanks for watching.